Mama Smart here. We are doing a little local water park splash pad thing today. Figured we'd try it out. It's right down the road from our house. Getting the kids all shoot up and hopefully have a good day. So we had a little freak out. Somebody didn't want to get in an inner tube. So now I am somehow in it holding her. <laughs> hey, Gigi, girlfriend! <laughs> My little feet sticking out. <laughs> what do you think? She hated it. <laughs> he had a good time. Huh. She wants to do a water slide. All right, Man Cub wants to do a water slide. Go that little splash zone. Oh, go down the slide. The slide. Yeah. <laughs> there she goes. What'd you think, Bob? <laughs> Weezer. Watch her. Watch her. I got him. What'd you think, man? Come. <laughs> Whoa. He just got hit. <laughs> or something he is not like it. <laughs> you all right, Bob? <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright, hold on. <laughs> They've got some kind of spray mechanism and he is not not into it, buddy. <laughs> you okay? It's okay. He is not in <laughs> to the splashing in his face. There's just water everywhere in there. I know. It's like water apocalypse. He's just wiping his eyes. He's not into it. Did you go down a slide with Dada? Yeah. You went down a slide with Dada? Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
I just wanted to do a quick little narration here and say that this water park had way too much water on the little splash pad area so it really wasn't toddler friendly i think it was more designed i guess for bigger kids because that water is just in your face like drowning you the entire time in the rain having a good old time <laughs> Are you having fun or are you taking a 
pipe dream? <gasps> oh my goodness. Are y'all covered in chocolate? Because we had to have chocolate ice cream, huh? <laughs> He's just covered. Are we gonna go get some chicken nugs? You want some chicken nugs? Yeah, and some french fries? Yeah, and then hopefully we'll have two knocked out kiddos. So, ended the water park. We got some cheeky nugs for the kids on the way home and we got some disgusting hamburgers that we will never go to that place again. But we ate, Weezer took a little nap, Mankub just watched TV, Mama had a bath. And then I'll insert the picture here. Weezer and I passed out on the couch together and took a little nap or I passed out. I don't know if she fell asleep again with me or not, but apparently I was tired. And then she saw her new stroller in the hallway and insisted we go for a walk so it's hot middle of the day in Louisiana in the south in the summer and it's hot but we are testing out Apple. our other Apple. double stroller that we got Apple. yeah for Disney Apple. World and see if we like this one better because this one is a back-to-back -back tandem instead of a side-by-side -side. so you don't have to fold it down to take it on the Skyliner and we're staying at Caribbean Beach Resort in October like right on the Skyliner hub the main hub so that would mean we would only have to break the strollers down anytime we go to Magic Kingdom or Animal Kingdom so I'm thinking I'm leaning towards this one. I just don't like how he doesn't sit up higher than her. So I don't know if he can be above her. And these shades kind of suck. They don't have the UPF. And it doesn't give him very good coverage. So I might have to rig our little stroller umbrella attachment to it and see if that makes it better. But I'm liking the ease of this one because number one, it has the single handlebar. Whereas the Juvie Ultralight one that we were contemplating, the umbrella one, has the two handles, so you can't one hand it, push it. Which doesn't sound like a big deal, but it is. <laughs> Especially if you want to like walk and drink your coffee. And again, not having to break it down on the Skyliner is my biggest thing. So, I don't know, we'll see. So we're just walking around the block, testing out the new stroller, and gonna go ahead and sign out and leave the blog here. Thank you guys for watching.